Let's talk about symptoms with canine asthma. Um, in talking about asthma, it essentially is a reaction, an allergic reaction of the airways to something in the environment. Uh, that can be candles, incense, um, cooking, uh, carpet cleaner, anything can cause a trigger of asthma. In dogs, we see asthma much, much less than we do in cats. This is a cat chest here. Um, essentially, what happens is when there is an asthma trigger, there is fluid that is produced within the airway, and that fluid gets in the way of, of oxygen um, exchange, obviously, and these animals have a hard time breathing. In dogs, a common symptom, if they're having an asthmatic type of reaction, is going to be open mouth breathing. So they'll be having their jaw open, panting if you will, but they're also at the same time really using their, their chest muscles to breathe heavier. Their gum color may be a little off, it may not be pink, it may be just a slightly pale or bluish tinge because they're not exchanging oxygen very well within their lung tissue. Other symptoms could be just laying around, being very lethargic, not eating or drinking, uh, coughing is another very, very common sign with asthma in, in dogs. If you think your dog is coughing for any reason, uh, or you think there's an asthmatic type of problem, check with your veterinary clinic. The way to diagnose asthma is by x-ray, um, x-ray films, and, and basically they'll have to look and see if there are signs of asthma and they can treat appropriately. Usually in asthma, uh, antihistamines, anti-inflammatories like steroids, um, and bronchodilators are typically used to manage them.